Hello everyone, how's it going? I'm Wakrendor and welcome back to more Hearthstone. Today we are in the Tavern Brawl yet again, and we are taking a look at the new Tavern Brawl, Encounter at the Crossroads. Encounter at the Crossroads. Pick a class, let's see what's in your deck this time. So apparently this is just all random deck cards. All random deck cards. So, any class we want. Which class do I want to play? What haven't I played in a while? Uh, let's pick a Shaman. Let's go Thrall. Let's, let's do this Thrall. I believe in you. I believe in you. Alright, so... I'm... This is curious. So I'm pretty sure what's happening... Uh, somebody posted this on... In the comments. I think it was on Reddit or uh, somewhere. But they're doing... Pre-made deck. Uh, you make your own deck. Pre-made deck, you make your own deck. Pre-made deck. And I think they're just alternating back and forth between all that. Which is fine with me. I think it's cool. Alright, so... We got some random cards. Let's swap him. I'm gonna keep Fire Guard Destroyer. And Forked Lightning. Alright. So it's literally completely random. And I believe that you can get multiples of even legendaries. Uh, so that's really cool. I'd like to get multiples of legendaries. As long as they're good legendaries. <laughs> All right, Haunted Creeper, whatevs, let's keep going. The coin. Oh, he's got an app Pagel. He's got the Pagel. All right, we got Fire God Destroyer, we got Haunted Creeper. I think I'm going to put the Creeper or Swordsmith? The end of your turn, get it for... Alright, let's just let's do the Creeper first. Damn, he's catching cards. He's catching cards. Alright. There you go. Unstable Ghoul. I'd like if someone made fan art of the Unstable Ghoul. And it's like him in a psychiatrist or therapist's office, and he's just like, I still don't know what to do with my life. That'd be pretty funny. Uh, should we do Forked Lightning? Yeah, why not? And then we will hit the ghoul. That's gonna happen, and now we'll drop Bring the sword smooth. Bring me steel. There we go. <laughs> All right. So we got two fire guard destroyers and an arcane golem. There's a void tear. And he sucks up the life of Nat Pagel. Although it doesn't give him too much, but gives him enough. Let's just drop the totem. And we get Healing Totem. So... Uh, I mean, it doesn't really matter what we do. I could kill him by hitting him with everything. Or I just go for his face. And an even stronger spider! Ding, da ding, da ding. Attack Overload. We can also drop Stormwind Knight or the Arcane Golem. Give me a quest. This questing adventure. All right, he'll hit that. That's fine because now I'm just going to kill that. And let's see. I think I'm gonna Stormwind Knight here and then take out the questing adventure. Uh, there's Dune Mall Shaman. I could also do 3 2 with the Arcane Golem, but I really want to kill the Questing Adventure. So we'll take that out, hit him in the face. He gets healed up. We're rolling. Alright. So now we'll have 6 mana, so I can do one of these plus a totem. Do I want a Dune Maul Shaman with Wind Fury? Or do I want the Fire Guard Destroyer? I think I'd rather have Fire Guard because he's a 3 6, plus he's going to gain stuff. And he won't attack the wrong minion. Alright. 
Violet Teacher. Let's drop the Fire Guard Destroyer. Alright, and he gets two attack. Another healing totem. Hit him in the face. Hit him in the face. Swag. Life tap. So you got nothing? You got nothing you can do? Dancing swords. However, I can very easily kill that and take a free card. Or I just hit him in the face. That's 8 damage. Uh, I could even drop that and get 12 damage out of it. Whenever your opponent casts a spell, it'll gain 1 attack. Uh, Alright, let's drop... I think we're going to drop the trog. Drop the trog. Wow, wow. Drag, no stupid. And let's... Hmm. Arcane Golem or Dune Mall Shaman? I can always drop the Arcane Golem. I can't always drop Destroyer Dune Mall Shaman. I'm going to drop the Dune Mall Shaman. Alright, and I'm just going to hit him in the face. Nice, I could have killed the dancing swords and then got healed up a bit, but that's fine. Pretty much one turn away from winning anyway, so I don't think it matters too much. I don't think it matters too much. Alright, I got an ancestral spirit. Give a minion death rattle and resummon this minion. Alright, let's go, dude. Pretty sure he lost. Pretty sure I got a solid win in my first crossroads battle. You can do it. I believe in you. I believe in you. You're almost out of time. Demon Heart. Eight. And yeah, let's drop Arcane Golem. And go to town. Go to town! Ah, your soul shall suffer. <laughs> Swag. Pack earned. Alright. So we got our first pack. I'll open the I'll open the pack of cards after we're done. So Shaman was fun. Let's try mm, Hunter, Paladin. Warrior might be fun. Let's try Warrior. Plus we got that skin. Or champion, you know, whatever. Ba -da -da, ba -da -da. Ba -da -da, ba -da -da. Finding opponent, who will it be? Oh, I almost got my old roommate. I didn't actually have an old roommate, so I don't know who it would have gotten. But, curious. Playing donkeys. Alright, I'm gonna get rid of like... Well, I'll keep Ogre Brute. Alright, we get charge against Stalag and Handsome Mechano. And the coin. Oh, it's this map again. Alright, I'm gonna light the fireworks. Aha! I lit it! I finally did it. Alright, we got a hungry crab. Let's drop this crab. He's pretty hungry. We light the other ones. He got Nat Pagel. Everybody keeps getting Nat Pagel except me. By everybody, I mean the last two people I played. Alright, so three. Could drop a Death Lord. Could drop the Ogre Brute. Might just coin into the Ogre Brute. I'm gonna do that. It's time. Come on guys, you can light. As people are saying it's when you hold it hold it open. But it closes after a while, so I don't get like I'm holding it. 
I don't know. <laughs> uh, let's see, Death Lord charge. To attack and charge. So we can get a friendly minion to attack and charge. We can do that. I'm going to do that for the crab. Take the cobra out. Kill the pagel. Or I'll hit him in the face. Either way, that's fine. It's fine with me. Silvermoon shall not fall. Silvermoon's not gonna fall. Not on his watch. Uh, let's. I drop Death Lord. Yeah, let's drop Death Lord. Oh my God! And he hit the. Whatever. <laughs> Damn it, ogre. Look how ready he is to fight, too. He's like, I got this one. This is going to be easy. And. Consecrate. And. Murloc Raider. Alright. Uh, we got a Warbot. So what can we do with our Warbot? We can also just play Stalag. Might be a good idea. That's five... I also do 2 1 2. I could do Mad Scientist, Warbot, Armor Up, and then take out uh, something here. I could take out the Murloc. Alright. Keeps catching cards though. Damn it, Pagel. Damn it, Pagel. Violet Teacher. Not. Origin Protector, that's annoying. Alright, well, there goes that. And he gets a Cobalt Guardian. Interesting. Uh, I got an Arcanite Reaper. What's that? 4 2. I can do Swordsmith. I do Swordsmith and then drop the Enhanced Mechano. I don't know if it's worth it here, though. Mm, actually, you know what? I, I think I can. I think it's worth it. I want to see what we get. Alright, so we got a Wind Fury. Nice, we got the Divine Shield I wanted. So now we can take him out. And with 2 2, we can take out Pagel. Fools! Alright, that's not too bad. Look at that, he gets an attack. Although I wish he didn't get that Cobalt Guardian, because it's pretty good. Hmm, <laughs> Dr. Boom! That's annoying. <laughs> and Cobalt Guardian gets Divine Shield. And he gets two Boom Bots. Alright. So. He's also going to hurt. And stuff. Okay. And he takes that him. Uh, we have Brawl! Oh, that is actually... A great card to have gotten in this situation. All right, so what do I want to get here? What do I want to do? Uh, I'm gonna hit him in the face. Hit him in the face and drop the brawl. <laughs> and God, that's so annoying. <laughs> All right, of course. <laughs> Literally, like, the worst possible outcome. I guess Dr. Boom might have been the worst possible outcome. But still, it's really annoying. Illuminator, Manta Ray, he's just dropping everything. All right. Uh, we got the Shield Master. 3-5. It's going to get killed, though. I guess we'll just drop him anyway, and then armor up. Alright. And that'll go down. Another Cobalt Guardian. Man, I would love some more board clear right now. I would love some more board clear. And 
ship's cannon. That is completely useless. <laughs> oh boy, let's just Arcanite Reaper and then... That's that. Game over. That's alright. Just wasn't our, just wasn't our game. Gave it our all out in the field today, but you know, did you know light enough fireworks? To really make it all worth it. It's all right. Uh, I do like this mode a lot though. I think it's fun. I'm almost 29 on the warrior. Uh, I'm gonna play one more. I think I'm gonna play. Druid, Rogue, Pre- I think Rogue might be fun. Let's try Rogue. Yeah, let's see who we get this time. Who do we get this time? It is... A Gord Critic. We almost got the Gord Critic. Valera versus Malfurion. VG Madness. All right, VG Madness. Let's go. Let's do this. Watch your back. All right. Swap the core hound. And Van Cleef. Nice. Nice. And we start with the coin. Wonderful. Beautiful. Uh. Turn. Get a blade flurry. Let's do attack while you have a mech. Motron, just manage shuffle this through copies it into your deck. Alright, let's drop the old Anoyotron in this situation. Actually, or I could just uh, weapon up. But I mean, if I have that, I'm gonna get three attack next turn. I'm gonna drop Anoyotron. Hello! Speak to me. All right, we got three, three mana this turn. We got Shadow Step. I could play Van Cleef pretty early on here and do quite a bit of damage, right? Let's see, three mana. So I'd play one turn for only minion, which could be you know anything. So that's two, three, four. Uh, each card plays. So make him a six-six. I think it might be worth it. I'm gonna do it. So we're gonna play the Stone Tusk Boar. Ain't even coin here. So I mean, hit him in the face. Hit him in the face, and then we Shadow Step. Let's bring uh, the Boar back, right? Cause he can attack again. Play the Boar. And then coin, and then Van Cleef. Oh my God! All right, yeah, <laughs> exactly. There we go. That worked out well. <laughs> I forgot I could coin into Van Cleef too. So that gives me pretty nice, uh, pretty nice early minion here. So let's see what he does. He's trying to go all out here. Draws a card. And there we go. Whenever you summon a pirate, gain stealth. Gang up. I think this is a good time to uh, gang up the Van Cleef. And uh, let's bring out the one eyed cheat. Why not? And 10 damage right to his face. And it'll take a 5 2 minion. Do Moonfire. And a Clockwork Dome. And hit me in the face. So next turn, he's going for the Van Cleef kill. And we get another Van Cleef. Uh, 
That would be good if I had a mech. I do not. So it is not the greatest right now. Uh, let's see. I can dagger mastery. Take out the gnome. And then... Uh, I guess we'll just hit him in the face again. Get him down to seven. And three mana. I guess let's play it anyway. So now he has to use all his cards to take out that Van Cleef. Unless he's got something. Nope. Alright. Ancient Brewmaster, Shapeshift, and he'll hit me in the face. Alright, what do we get? We got an Echoing Ooze. Summon an exact copy of this mini at the end of the turn. I guess we'll just throw it down. It's whatever. Uh, let's see. No, not Blade Flurry. So what's that? 2-2 two, two for each card play this turn. This gives him 4-4. Four, four. It'd be a 6-6 six, six if I Blade Flurry. Might be worth Here it. We go. Let's do that. Oh, wait, it doesn't matter because, you know, I don't have enough mana to play. <laughs> Uh, so, let's end our turn. I just need that, I need that one card. I need that one card. Go well. Kazan Mystic. Glory to the Blood Knight. Alright, we get Burly Rockjaw Trog. So, whenever uh, you cast a spell, gain two attack. When your opponent casts, whenever your opponent casts a spell, gain two attack. So now it's three. So I mean, he's just gonna be a four-four if he comes out now. I don't know if it's worth it. He's gonna kill this with that, and the four-four. He'd kill with the Kazan Mystic. Then he'd be a three. I don't know if it's worth it. I'm just going to hit him in the face here. Hit him in the face again. Alright. He's down to five. This is actually a pretty, int uh, a pretty intense game right now. Cause I'm, we don't know what we have in our deck. He's got five cards, so he might have some stuff to do. Alright, he's going to do that. Gonna hit the ooze. And he'll hit me in the face with the mystic and play junk bot. And he's up to six. And I'm down to seventeen. Goblin Auto Barber. Give your weapon one attack. Oh. That's not too shabby. So what I could do here is Goblin Auto Barber. No. Wrong. <laughs> I would attack, so that's two, so many four, six. Also, ba Auto Barber, Blade Flurry, and then. Now, back in a hit with the weapon. Damn. I want to play Van Cleef. It's the big thing. So, what is that? Mm, I want to get a plus two weapon. So, I can just. Alright, I'm going to hit him in the face. I'm going to summon the weapon, Goblin Auto Barber, Blade Flurry. Alright, that works. So he's down to three. <laughs> oh my god. All I need is Eviscerate, that's like all I need. <laughs> Or that one that does three damage, Shadow Blade or whatever it is. Alright, he plays Argent Commander, that's annoying. I hate the Argent Commander. Especially when you give it Mark of the Wild and then buff it up even more with uh, Whirling Blades. Pretty annoying. What do we get? Edwin Van Cleef, thank you. Why did I. 
Why did I play that card? Why did I play? <laughs> Why did I play you, Van Cleef? Oh my God! All right, so let's just double Van Cleef here. Hit him in the face. Oh my God! I can't even attack him. He's a taunt. <laughs> well, that's that's not good. I like how my gang up ended up screwing me over <laughs> in the end of things. Actually, I don't even know. It could have it could have given me multiple Van Cleefs anyway, and then my gang up gave me even more Van Cleefs. Who'd have thought I'd have too many Van Cleefs? Oh well. Either way. <laughs> Uh, let's open the pack. That's still really fun. I like the whole thing of just picking a random deck and then, uh, you get random cards with it. I think that's a cool, a cool game mode. A good tavern brawl. Nothing really good here. And whatever. Alright. <laughs> uh, either way, thank you for watching. Uh, if you haven't tried this tavern brawl, go check it out. It's pretty fun. And yeah, okay, okay, so.